Bowles is double. Dominique goes away and spots up a three. Bowles on. And that's the way you run the two-man game. Dominique spread out and spotted up outside the three. Stole the pass away from Mike Sanders. Battle. Dominique. Three-point drive. Bulls up. Dominique has drilled two three-pointers. Here's Valentine. Now Carr and Hot Rod Williams are about to get into it. Williams is certainly not a fighter. I don't know if Carr is either. <laughs> I wouldn't although, recommend it for Hot Rod. <laughs> although Carr has the body for it. Right. Spud, they want to go to Carr. Elo. Jump back. Now Dominique will bring it over to get it to Carr. Neek takes a three. Bulls up. Dominique has hit three three-pointers. He has 32. A little jump hook with the right hand. Forced him to go the other way, and uh, and he kind of gets dizzy, gets lost. He doesn't like to go the other way. For three, Dominique. And Nick can have a big game tonight. Uh, the Warriors beat the uh, Hawks earlier in the season on the November Rebound and ladder. Rivers ahead to Spud. Webb in the front court. Cross court, Wilkins. Three-point try. Good again. Hawks have hit four three-pointers already. Time out, Golden State. It's a small crowd, but they're on their feet. Atlanta leads by 12. Wilkins for three. Yes, sir. Boy, he is shooting it tonight. 33 for Dominique. And there is Dominique Wilkins, who is the number two scorer in the NBA behind Michael Jordan. Wow, when these two teams clash, you get a regular shootout between Dominique and Michael. Kept it alive for Kevin Willis. Back outside, Dominique for three. And the Hawks are on the board as Dominique Wilkins. I give a pat on the back to John Contact. Away by Kevin Willis. Took a hand to the nose, it looked like, as he pulled by two. Now Michael Jordan guarding Dominique Wilkins. Adam Keefe's had a good pick that time, freeing up Dominique for three. Oh, Dominique. He has 16 points, and the Hawks have the lead. He loves playing against Chicago. He lights them up every time he plays against them. He will tell you the biggest challenge to him of any game he plays all season is when he has to go head-to-head -head with Michael Jordan. He loves this situation. But Trent Tucker is starting to heat up as they march towards the playoffs. 49% field goal shooting. And as you said, beat 41 from three-point land. Well, Dominique answers the three with a three of his own. His third three-point basket of the night. Dominique with 21 points in this first half. Hawks down by two. They've held the opposition under 50% from the field, including the first half for Chicago tonight. Dominique, a three-pointer, another one. He now has 30 points, and we're only two minutes into the third quarter. That's his fourth three of the night. Kick and roll and quickly after it with the double team. And here's the three by Dominique who continues to hit. He is five of five from the field and three of three from three-point territory. And Nick Lewon. Oh, little one. <laughs> the Bunsen burner has been lit, baby. He shot almost 55% over the last six games and almost 35 points a game. You can see the damage he has done tonight. Over the last six games, he's averaging about 35. He, he's just been in a zone. The team to shoot over 50%, 53%. In fact, is what opponents have shot out the road against Minnesota. That's a couple things. One is teams tend to shoot. Oh, I mean, that didn't touch Man, anything. Alive. He is four of four net. from downtown. They've got 12 here so far in the third quarter. Minnesota's got 16, so the Bulls bounce scored, and that was a nice outside shot. It's another three by Dominique Wilkins, who has gone five of six. He has 38 points, and he is six away from tying a, C a yeah, season high of 44. He is unconscious, too, because he shot that one because the shot clock was going down. Contact. Rivers and Theus with Lovingston, Moses, Dominique, so Mike has reunited his starters. 540 remaining in the half. Here's Neek. Neek posting up and catches low for the turnaround. Got it again. Dominique has 13, and he is starting to feel it. Beautiful. Sanders is a good defensive player, but he, like no one else, can guard Dominique Wilkins one-on-one. -on -one. Looking for Neek, and well, they should. Sanders forces him way out. Way out. Too far out for Dominique to catch the ball against Sanders. Moses right finds Theus. Six on the shot clock. Here's Neek. The drive. The fake. The jumper is good. Beautiful. Dominique has 17, and when a great scorer feels it, watch out. He can shoot with his eyes closed. They are now. 
On the deep left wing, here's Neek. The fake and the jumper. It's good. Count the basket. He got fouled on the play. You know, I know we've mentioned this thing on another broadcast. What people don't know about Dominique, like Dr. J, is he's so strong. Now there, his jumper was stopped, but he's, his fingers are so strong, he was able to shoot a nice, smooth jumper. Yes, here we see Dominique going left. Nice little pump fake, gets a lot of contact, but stays with it. As you mentioned, he's a very strong player. He's like one big muscle. 15 remaining in the third. Two-man game battle, and Dominique. Here's Neek against Nance for the jumper. Bullseye! Dominique is magnifique tonight. He has 27. Another beautiful shot by Dominique. The last two shots, John, have been 9.9 .9 out of 10. Mark Price shot a beautiful three-pointer, and Dominique returned the favor. Have the ball. The Hawks have four more home games here before they hit the road again. I'll tell you about that as we go along. The opens again. Only a two-pointer this time. But he'll get the shot all night. State, that certainly has hurt them, allowing the Hawks to get up 30 shots to 19 in the first quarter for Golden State. Dominique made a heck of a move. Higgins played him well. But you can't stop him when he's got it all going. He's six out of nine on the night. There's ten rebounds in the game already. As Spud Webb heads to the front court. Dominique handles the ball. Wilkins against Higgins. Shoots the jumper. Got it. 24 for Wilkins. Conge up top. Wilkins over eight for two, and he got him. He's in their offensive zone. Dwayne Farrell checks back into the Atlanta scheme of things. And Bobby Weiss going to the smaller, quicker lineup. Neek for two, and he got him. 28 for Wilkins. More fouls in this game for the two teams. It's been one of those kind of nights. Dominique. Get in there. It's He's got 43. And yeah, he was putting the body English on that one on his running down the court. They're not sitting on their hands. They're very interested in what's going to transpire tonight. Dominique Wilkins. Dominique his first two-point field goal of the first quarter. He now has five points on the night. Baseline jumper, Dominique Wilkins. He is warming up. He has hit his last three. He now has nine first quarter points. Well, Pete Kevin. Slow for the Chicago Bulls, heating up as they're heading into the playoffs. A nine point lead now for Chicago. They're replacing Scotty Pippen's points with good performances tonight by players off the bench. Dominique Wilkins has been about the only consistent scorer for Atlanta all night. He has 23 of Atlanta's 44 points. You know, I've never ceased to be amazed by Dominique Wilkins. Night in, night out, he finds ways to put points on the board. Contact, thinking about shooting. Seven seconds left on the shot clock. Dominique will take it over Horace Gray. Oh, Nail it. Dominique with 27 points. And it's back to a fight. Looking for Dominique behind the pick set by Adam Keith. 36 now for Dominique Wilkins tonight. A bit too far, but what I like about it is you watch Christian Layton. He definitely has a nose for the ball. Oh, Dominique Wilkins! 31 first half points. You can't do anything with a guy that's simply like that. I mean, it's going in, coming out, going back in. 12 of 17, Dominique Wilkins, 4 of 5 from downtown. But you're looking at Dominique, who's just had a phenomenal game with 31 points on 18 shots. Four, five, three pointers. Well, you take that as a, as a night. We're talking about a half of basketball that he's already accumulated those numbers. Season high, 44. Career high, 57. Contact corrals it. And here comes Steve Hudson. They've only got a mismatch inside. Altman is being guarded by Michael Williams. Blanks is on Wilkins. Shot clock at 10. Plenty of time. Let's see what Dominique does. Oh, Dominique Wilkins! He's shooting and returning, running the other way, giving the crowd a little bit of his mind. 40 points for Dominique. 353rd quarter. He's going to get a new season high this game tonight against Minnesota. I'm liking Christian's game. I mean, I really, you know, I've seen this guy grow. There's no way that matchup is going to last. There's no way. you got three guards, but there's no way that Lance Blanks can guard Dominique Wilkins. Not if you allow him to get the ball quickly. You see right here, this is a runner going off the wrong leg away from the basket. And all of a sudden, you get it right here. Now watch, before the double team can get there, he's already started it up. So there's no way you can stop him. He has 42 points. 
the most points ever scored against the Timberwolves was 45. That yep. was by Michael Jordan in the very first game the Bulls and Wolves ever met. I, I'll make a suggestion that that probably will get broken in the next two days. Hey, I'll go out on the limb. I'm a kind of guy that goes out on the limb. What's wrong with that? You're a typical coach. Oh, well, excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> And Dominique has exploded for 43. He has hit five three-point shots. This is the Timberwolf Television Basketball Network. Six assists, two. He almost has a triple-double. Wilkins to get the new season high. 45 for the human highlight film. Dominique Wilkins. I don't mind seeing people get score a lot of points, but I didn't exactly expect to see him score 45, 50 points tonight. Uh -uh. And we still got a quarter to go. Yeah. His uh, career high 57. Oh, able to block his shot. Here's Price ahead for Sanders who drives. Blocked by Dominique. And Dominique never stops improving. Not a bad post up player either. There's the jump hook. Short. Rebound Dominique. Atlanta is playing at this stretch. 90. Underneath is Nance. Knocked away though and picked up by Dominique. Excellent defense by Dominique helping out. Hits up ball. And down by eight. 4 13 or remaining. Doherty, Dominique tries to knock it away. Doherty gets it back. Dominique wound up with Doherty. That's not his man. Doherty tried their old globe, try to move on Dominique there too, but Dominique wasn't going for that. Held his ground. Did Alley it high. No. Rebound. Nance knocked away by Dominique. Picked up by Price. Away. They lead by 11. Price to John Williams for the drive. Blocked by Neek. Nance, jumper. No. And Doherty fouled Dominique over the shoulder. John, I don't think the Hawks can play any better. Atlanta now by 17, breaking it open with a minute 20. Harper stolen by Dominique. <laughs> Moses ahead. Down and uh, kind of forced that one, but there's the type of defense he played last night. He heads the other way, finds Spud. Good pass, Webb, basket looking. <laughs> He's come out two nights in a row. Now he's had the assignment on Bird, and now he's had this, he's got the assignment on Chris Mullen. So having to go up against two tough offensive performers, but it seems to generate his uh, his offense when he plays tough defense. And he even admitted that. Good alertness on his part as he sees the pass coming up the court. Is able to intercept it. He'll hit Spud Webb on the right. Now he'll split in the go right in behind Johnson, split the defense, and get another two points. And the Hawks are picking up where they left. Farrell can't buy it. Wilkins keeps it alive. Great effort. Saves it. Farrell with it. Richmond on the deck, and Rivers gets a layup and a foul. And a that's hustling play by Dominique set all that up. That's exactly what Neek has been doing all season long, making plays like that, not just concentrating on the offensive end of the court, just a great effort on the part of Dominique Wilkins, and not many players who would have been able to make this play. Watch the quickness of Neek on this knockout of He tips it away, up in the air, presence of mind to control the ball and get it out far enough to one of his teammates. Third foul on Higgins. And the free throw by Rivers. Play with it. Out the pass. Knock loose. Let's see if Nick's all right. Thanks for dropping by, Dominique. Yeah, he comes up limping hello. a little bit. And Rick threw his bottled water under the court. Childish display on your part. Tim Hardaway. Hardaway misses. Rebound. Higgins drew the foul as he missed. Over yet, folks. Here comes Hardaway against Webb. And a foul. He'll shoot two. No goaltending. Ball no. shoots for two. Doesn't get any. And that's your ball game. Dominique with a rebound. And it's all over. And it's fitting that the last rebound in the game that clinches it goes so to After the second game of the season, the Atlanta Hawks got off to an early lead. But Michael Jordan's 35 points brought the Bulls back late in the game. Dominique provides the fireworks in what's been the season's most fantastic finish. It was one month later in the Hawks' nest when Jordan voiced his opinion early. Kevin Willis scored 31 points, and Atlanta ended up on the line 40 times, only missing once. Dominique wrote in a new NBA record, going 23 for 23 from the charity line. Bill Jackson could only watch in frustration as the Hawks won the second meeting by nine. They hope to keep their record perfect against the champs next. Oh, 
Mookie Blaylock around the pick. Good pick set by Dominique that time. Freed up Mookie for the open jumper. This fourth point, we are tied. Uh, see, Mookie Blaylock has taken a lot of threes this year, but watch this time. Nice pick by Dominique Wilkins on a classic screen and roll. Now he just reads it. See, watch here. He sees I got a little space here. Ryan McCray can't stay with me. I'm too quick. And he pulls up and knocks down the jump. Purdue, Michael Jordan, and B.J. Armstrong for Chicago. Stacey Ogman, Mookie Blaylock, Kevin Willis, Dominique Wilkins, and John Conn. Like it's headed towards uh, a, a what they think is a big win for them because they have not been able to beat the Atlanta Hawks. Where the help is going to be in order to keep Dominique Wilkins from being able to drive down the lane. Smith guarded by Mays looking for Leighton. Knocked away by Dominic. Lynch by Graham. Shot clock at six. Into McCann who's had the accurate shot but he misses his third and seven. Carr on the drive. Off the knee in the lane. This is off the contact. What a pass. But there's the block by Tree Rollins. Cleveland blocks a lot of shots. Battle and Rivers with Moses, Dominique, and Antoine Carr. This is a very good offensive team on the floor for the Hawks. Neek double finds Rivers underneath and he lays it in on the board. With the best of them. If they, they're 10 and 1 when the team shoots over 50%. Dominique. It's obvious that the first web for a three, and he got that first time. Here comes John Battle. He's got Moncrief with him as he reaches the front court. The trailer is Wilkins. Whistle sounded first. Let's see. Loose ball foul before the whistle and before the horn. Oh, man. 15 I mean, remaining in regulation. Dominique. Now, what a pass. Get an opportunity to see it right here as Nico get the pass, goes up for the jumper, has presence of mind to see the court, finds his open teammate Willis for the easy two. I love to see those kind of plays. Five assists for Dominique in this ballgame. Score here. Or at least stop the Warriors next time. John Battle. That's a big basket. Timeout Golden State. John Nelson calls timeout with 107 left. Wow. With 6.30 remaining. All right, there's a situation I was talking about. John Conkett becoming an offensive force tonight, knocking down his third straight shot. Playlock, Farrell, Keith, and Wilkins for Atlanta. Four out of 15 from the field. Then they make seven out of nine. They had uh, 12 points in the first nine minutes and 13 points in the last three minutes. Eight points for John Conkett tonight. It's good for your team morale. Helps that win the next game. That was the first point, by the way, the Purdue free throw scored by somebody. Henson has played the entire time, starting at the point. Rusty Mookie Blaylock to Wilkins finds Concan. He'll spot him. In college, he took that shot all the time. At SMU. At SMU. Can with 12. Two-man game, Dominique Kevin. Wilkins, nice pass off to Willis. He was open at 12 for Kevin Willis in the game. Throws it away. Graham. Nice move by Lake. Dominique. Look out. Back to Graham. What a pass by Dominique Wilkins. We talked about his game has been varied and spread out, and he's got four assists tonight. 45 points, five rebounds. 91-74, the Atlanta Hawks. That's the score going to the fourth quarter. doing everything right now. I don't think they can play much better than they're playing right now. Dominique has 37 as he hits the line. 38. <laughs> Dominique has one more and this foul shot is good. Nick has 39. I would say he had that move pretty well scouted. And he brought it back. See, he's a right-handed player. He went to his going this way to his left and brought it back with his right. Wilkins shoots two. Three fouls on Marshall Luna. Fifty-eight, forty-five, Hawks. Well, for having taken the ball down and done what he did on that play. And he's now an analyst for the Clippers part-time. I understand. I paid him for that. Down by six, they keep hanging around. Wilkins drew the foul as he missed. Shoots two. I think Meek just got a little confused right there because Spud was out near us, out high, and was wide open. Dominique. 
Well, I was saying that. I think the Warriors can continue to shoot 60%. They're not. They're shooting better. <laughs> Kanka. No foul there. Wilkins and a foul. Tough break for him. Good hustle, though, to get that second opportunity. Dominique says rats. He thought he had a chance at a three-point play. Well, it was rats or something like that. Now he'll shoot two. Well, free throw is good again. Now the chess match continues. Is rebounding position. It's a three-point game. Yeah, major. Well, what a valiant effort, though, by this Warrior ball club. Neek hasn't missed one yet tonight. He's 11 out of 11. Now time is called again for whatever reason. Dominique came in as 79% free throw shooter. He's yet to miss one. He's 11 of 11 from the line. This would be the knockout. That's it. Timeout, Golden State. Free throw at the other end for Dominique. Dominique missed the first, going for the second. And Dominique now with a 10 point first quarter. Yeah, intimidation on anybody. He's complaining. But what's happened? Something that uh, Sam Smith from, from the Chicago Tribune, you know, the guy that wrote the Jordan rules, he, he told me that he thinks that Dominic there's a. Brookins, the team's only all star, but he's 33. Mm -hmm. Doesn't make any difference, Craig. He's having a great year. When Dominique scores, when he scores over 30, they have a much better record. Hawks are still very dependent upon him for their offense. They get the ball to Dominique, particularly in the open court. He's as good as ever. Despite last night's loss, 16 and 8 when he scores over Dominique, 30. a big first half, 25 points. Continuing his outstanding performance against Chicago. Well, it looks like he's headed towards another big rebound game. by Kevin Willis. He had seven rebounds tonight. Nothing but action. The NBA. No babies right allowed. The top four. And Dominique at the free throw line now with 33. And you can see what Wilkins and Jordan have done tonight. A lot of pride in both of these guys. And when they're on the same court playing one another, they each want to make sure they are the one that comes out on top. Well, what's interesting, Dominique it, Wilkins is the oldest player on the Hawk roster, one of the older players in the league. He played last night, had 36, and he's the most energized of the Hawk players out there. Mains. Five and a half remaining in the first half. 25. You got to get down and double. Dominique. He's fouled. Yeah, you got to get down and double Dominique. He's just he's got it going too much offensively. Paul got pushed up when the defense when Leitner got fouled. Didn't get it down before, and you see Dominique get it, try to go over the top of the rim. And get a lucky break. Dominique Wilkins uh, broke Bob Pettit's team scoring record earlier this season. The NBA Player of the Month for February. We told you before for the last uh, six games has been averaging just under 35 points a game. Jacques Dominique Wilkins, born in France. And he's got 26 tonight. To that I say bon appetit. Bon appetit. So, uh, you guys from Dallas probably don't know. Either. Wilkins hammered by McCann, who holds on to him and handcuffs him inside. Boy, <laughs> he's <laughs> man he's wrestled him. The big bear inside the forest. Bob McCann was all over Dominique. Look at that. You see, Nick was going in, and he made sure Nick can get a chance to get it up. <laughs> big Bobby. We're halfway through Bob this. Bob McCann has handled. Now he gets pushed. That's what this yeah, ball was bouncing out though. It was not in the cylinder. The point should count and he should be at the line. I don't know if Dominique should be at the line, but maybe Willis who tapped it in. Yeah, I could it was hard to see if he yes. had, if the ball was on the cylinder and he tapped it in, but they obviously felt that was the case. He's got two shots. So he gets two shots instead. So he's got 32. On a release, Kev. Here we go. Come on, Michael. Thirty three for Wilkins this game Dominic Wilkins has put in thirty three points and the Atlanta Hawks lead by 13 Wilkins one of four players that you obviously would have to consider as prime MVP candidates Michael Jordan of course you can see what he's done Barkley Wilkins and Elijah Second, what do you think? Scoring. Let me let me ask you that question. Well it probably is a factor but but you know obviously you look at a guy like Jordan who has led the league in scoring six consecutive years. Uh, I think it makes that guy stand out some more, wouldn't you? Barkley's uh, character. And In and out, rebound, system. Dominique on the drive. The whole up the York is gone. Beautiful. 
beautiful, beautiful left hand hook by Dominique Wilkins. He passes the ball right away. If you pass it right away, you're going to get open shots. Dominique on the drive, got pushed by Sanders, but they're not going to count the shot. That time the Hawks used the advantage of Dominique. Dominique trying to post. Sanders forces him out, but Neek gets the basketball. Now Neek operates for the jumper, gone off the glass. The bank is open tonight. Rivers ahead for Theus. Reggie, the drive to Neek for the hook. It's good. Dominique has 41. And Atlanta now by... And a terrible play by the Warriors. They were three men bringing it up, and they managed to lose it. Wilkins from 13. He's got 30. And just like that, the Atlanta lead is up to 11. Wilkins 11 for 17 from the field. It's a five-point Chicago lead again. DJ is also the best field goal shooter on the Chicago Bull roster, shooting 50%. Matchup again with Michael Jordan guarding Dominique Wilkins. Wilkins spins around Michael. Nice move by Dominique. And he now has 18 points in this first half. Dominique Wilkins has had a season high of 44. He's already got 18 tonight. And he's gone 7 of 10. Look at this. Oh, and in the Dominique Wilkins with 20 points in the first quarter of play. And Sellers was the victim that time. You see, watch, he'll give the fake because he uh, normally goes up with this one. And he gives a good hard fake to Brad Sellers, who hadn't played a lot of minutes, and Brad goes for it. And you can see his enthusiasm, Dominique. He has 20 of his team's 38 points. And 38 points in a quarter <laughs> is ton. way too many points. You said it. He went up hard. He made the hard fake. That means he committed and he knew he'd get the call if he went in like it. Well, when a guy is going the way Dominique is, that's what'll happen. You all of a sudden. I'm more concerned about him shooting the ball and you forget about the things like shot and breaking down. Ogden uh, with the basket last time. Willis will try this time. It's, he gets it off to Wilkins. Look out, Dominique Fred Hunt. He goes up against Doug West. Did anybody stop Dominique Wilkins oh, in a corner? Not yeah, you can see, once he hit the rim, you can see that he had control. He has 29 first half points, and we've got four and a half minutes remaining in the second quarter. Dominique Wilkins has given the Atlanta Hawks a 17 point lead. He has missed just five in 16 shots. He is on fire. The Hawks, 57. Minnesota. I stand corrected. They made him go right. He made a nice right handed jumper off the glass. Now the double team on Dominique about it all the time. But you know what? They keep hanging on to him. And I think they're smart for doing it because he can do one thing. He can put the ball in the basket. There's always room for a guy that can do that. Dominique drawing a lot more defensive attention. As this game moves along, there's the jump hook by Kevin Willis. Need to get him scoring again. See everything. You'll see right here. You watch. Coming out is Dominique. And I watch two people kill with Dominique. And you see Henson sees that there's miscommunication. Brad Sellers makes it, and you can see Kevin Willis gets the ball to go inside. So you got to keep your rebound, head up. Rebound, Levinson. Looking. Great rebound. Knocked away. Dominic regains and lays it in. And Moses Wait. steals the inbound. Dominic on the drive. Goes to the hole and lays it in. We're tied at 20. The sold out Omni is rising to the occasion. Great defense. Weak side defense. Rivers to Neek on the drive. His layup is good. That's team defensive player that the Hawks have. And here Dot goes to his favorite target, Dominique, who scores and gets the crowd and his team emotionally charged. It on the rim. Good call. Offensive. 245 remaining. Dominique gets free and lays it in. Great pass, and don't forget about the pick that freed Dominique. And he's got it back. Kept working, finally hammered it in there. He's got 41. It's by five. Dominique got around McCray that time, trying to steal along the baseline with Darrell Walker. And he called for the foul. Nick Versace and I will be selecting the Budweiser player of the game. Last time we were in this building, the player of the game is the guy at the free throw line right now, Dominique Wilkins, who had that tremendous block causing the jump ball. And for the Hawks, he's playing against Chicago. Here you see him going down the baseline, finding some kind of way to get the ball in the basket, got the hit, went to the free throw line, 
He's just racking up the he points. the time in, the, in, in game one when they won here in Chicago and he got down to the jump ball. Dominique Wilkins against Michael Jordan. You had about 19,000 people at Chicago Stadium saying, ah, oh, this is a fate to complete. No question, Jordan's going to get the tip. Dominique gets the tip, comes over and talks to us and said, hey, everyone thought that Michael was going to get the tip. He said, I knew I was going to get it. Shoot him right. all night long. Get out and make him put the ball on the floor. He is eight for eight from the field. Dominique, oh, nice give and go. 38 points. Three point shots attempted and made this year. Look at Dominique Fry. So Dominique Wilkins, who has started this game with 15 points, and he has been on fire, six of nine. You can see the human highlight film here. And the Hawks lead by 12, 30 to 18. This is the Minnesota Timberwolves television basketball. Team. So there's old Quinn. No, this is just Quinn. <laughs> no. <laughs> Tom there's, Hannibal will talk to Randy a bit later. There's ancient Quinn. <laughs> <laughs> like to say hi to Randy's dad, Ralph. Back up in Minnesota. Big fan of our broadcast. Wilkins down the lane. Dominique Wilkins puts it in. Nine of 14 from the field. And 23 points for Dominique. Nice defense. Mays. Dominique in and up and oh. down. Dominique Wilkins. Wilkins now with 25 points. His season high is 44. And we are now just halfway through the second. Oh, the the shot is no good. Rebound, Doherty. Knocked away and stolen by Dominique. Dominique has eight, and Atlanta leads 22-20. They're physical enough. You see this last replay of Dominique stealing it and getting the layup. But Brad Doherty is physical, but not ultra. What a place. Ahead for Dominique, who drives and jams. Cleveland 78. Atlanta's lead down to eight. Carr trying to post up against Hot Rod Williams. Drives, spins, can't get in. Theus, the drive off the knee in the lane. He drives a James. Oh, what a drive by Dominique. I mean, if there's a better athlete, I want to meet him. Dominique is magnifique. He has 34. Great game. Dominique had a 10, obviously, on that dunk. Went through the middle of the lane. You'll be, you'll be seeing going. that across the country on oh, the late night telecast. I'll sure. tell you that. Here's, oh, what an athlete. It's do like, it from a tuck. Go down to your knees and come back up again. How does he do that? He's like a diver or something. <laughs> well, one thing, he jumps high to begin. <laughs> <laughs> With no board. <laughs> Natural light player of the game. <laughs> I don't think you have to be exactly a genius to figure out who we have chosen he is good old Neek. Dominique Wilkins scored 41. He had three three pointers. He made some of his brilliant athletic moves. But I think he played a brilliant game Mike on both ends Last of the night floor. against Boston. They are smoking. They're seven of eight from the field. Alton Lister is in the game and throws it away. There's Neek. At this rate the Hawks will score more than 300 points tonight. I bet they don't but it would be <laughs> fun to watch. 20 to 6 draws a crowd and listen. And there's Wilkins. There were four guys on one side of the floor, yet Wilkins got the rebound and jammed it home. Let's watch Dominique on the shot. There you see all the blue jerseys, four of them in your picture, and there's Hardaway, and Neek sneaks inside and takes it home. Nice. Battle goes to the hole. No. Wilkins. 39 for Neek. You can see the, the penetration. See, Higgins had to go help out on the penetration by battle. Left Neek open to take it home. Here's it from, from the slam can. You'll see Neek sneak into the right of your screen as Higgins left his man. And BJ trying to get the pass to Grant. Had a tip by Mookie Playlock. Stolen by Dominique. Three on one. Dominique's going to go in for the easy two. He has seven. And the Hawks have grabbed the lead. 13-12. Well, Mookie made a nice choice there. He started. Well, let's take a look at this man, Dominique. Gets the ball over to Mookie on a classic three-on-one. He looks off Kevin Willis. Right back to Dominique. But sometimes even Michael's best don't work. Now Mookie Blaylock down to Dominique. He'll try to put a show on the other end. And Dominique.
Dominique Wilkins has seven in the quarter and 32 in the game. The next dead ball before reporting. Well, there's Dominique just finishing up with a resounding slam, but there's sizes and ability are encouraged to hoop it up at the oh, Timberwolves last year. So we've right. taken a look at uh, individual records, team records, how they apply to these different players and you like. If you had to vote tonight, who would you pick? If I had to vote tonight, I still have to say the way they're going to do it, I think Charles Barkley has a better chance than anybody else. Do you really? I've never seen him quite handled that way before. <laughs> Dominique Wilkins tonight, the big man, a season high, 44 points. Final is in, 121-103, the Atlanta Hawks on the Timberwolves Television Basketball Network.